This is Raj getting on his bike, and uh, he's got Nikki's flag, Nikki's helmet. It's a great tribute to his brother. Obviously, the, the Hayden family are all close to all of us in the paddock, and um, this was something that, you know, Raj felt like uh, if anybody was going to do it, he wanted to be the guy to do it. And, uh, Raj is going to go do a lap uh, in honor of his brother. And it's going to be a great way for us to be able to find a little bit of closure in the paddock because I know that a lot of us were at the test at Pittsburgh when this happened to Nikki while we were in Italy. And you can see the amount of support of everybody going down uh, pit lane right now. So Roger Hayden on the stock, actually, Suzuki GSX-R1000 with the flag. And uh, Roger's wearing his normal race leathers, but there's some accents to take notice of. Number one is yeah, the replica of Nikki Hayden's helmet that Roger has on the Arai helmet, as well as there's some special gloves that were made by Alpine Stars and, and boots. You can kind of see those unique boots. They actually have NH69s all over them, and they were just a special thing for this particular event. And in speaking with uh, Roger's girlfriend, Dana, they're going to take this gear and uh, frame it with the flag after he's done on this ride. But this is uh, a ride of respect. and. You know, when, when Roger Hayden was asked to do this ride by Moto America, uh, he said, absolutely, I want to do it 100%. Even though we're only, you know, a short time away from uh, the start of the Superbike race, of course, we have the Super Sport before then, that Roger wanted to do this because there's no one more appropriate in the paddock, obviously, than his brother. And I think really, to be honest with you, Greg, uh, Raj has just shown an amazing amount of resolve uh, in the last week specifically. You know, you and I were, were lucky enough to be down in Owensboro for that. Raj has been very focused, and he's handled this in a, a, a way beyond what anybody could, could, could possibly imagine how well he's handled this. Uh, for him to be able to go out and do this even a couple hours before his race, I think it really shows where he's at mentally. He's very focused on his job this weekend, and I think this is going to be a, a, a good way for Raj, too, um, to show the fans, you know, the solidarity that they've shown him and his family and everything else. Um, this is going to be good closure for him, too, to be able to do this for his brother, for his family, um, for obviously for Jackie, for, for Nikki's fiance, and all over the world. I know uh, Magello's got some big plans also in MotoGP. Uh, like I said, Nikki was so loved and so well respected by everybody in the motorcycling world. You know, it's very hard. You can't find anybody that would ever say a bad word about Nikki. And, um, you know, Earl and Rose and all of them down in Owensboro, uh, our thoughts continue to stay with them through this whole thing. And um, uh, this is just a really nice, nice sight to see Raj doing a lap, uh, doing a lap for Nikki with the big 69 shining.